is I use the Monet way to make this flower. And you can see I use the dots and the squares around. So to make everything in here is very, very fuzzy. And suddenly this flower comes out in three dimension without to do that much, but mainly by to fuzz around it, to make it very loose. Look in this floor and this one here. I don't mix in of the color. From far, you see it in three dimension, the stuff. But actually, if you come close, you're going to see the brown separately, the blue separately, the yellow separately, the green separately. Everyone separated, but from your space, from your distance, you're going to see them all mixed together in your eyes. From that distance, you can see them all mixed. You see that? This is a little bit of realistic photography, but in the, at the same time, it starts almost to come like abstract, but is, of course it's realistic. This is I go, most of it like dots, 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 and in the bottom here, line, 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 and that's it, and it make it realistic, abstract. You can see everything without I do anything, and all of it's like what you call it, line. The lines, all of it make it. This is I go with my friend Tom out of the city to take this uh, pictures. It's not in Orwa actually, out of Orwa a little bit. But I love that it's like a lot of uh, walls. This picture I was uh, more uh, focusing to showing the details of the splash of the water. And this place, it's a little bit, you're feeling it's very cozy, you're feeling that I want to be there. Just beautiful enough that you're feeling that I won't be there all the time. Sunrise. And this is uh, the end of this series of, of realism. Uh, later. After that, we're going to go for something else.